Hi. I'm a little nervous. I haven't done one of these for a while. Uh, Adam Olinger, Adam Does Movies. It's a pretty big channel. You've probably heard of me. A lot of people shaking their heads no. All right, I'm here to try out for a, a few different parts for the hit upcoming Tom and Jerry film, or what I presume will be a hit. It's Tom and Jerry. <laughs> Which one's Jerry, the mouse or the cat? She has no idea. She's like, what, what are you, like 18? She's not, she walked away. All right, here's Tom. Like, zoinks, Jerry, I'm super hungry. Shaggy, I'm not familiar. I read in the script there are pigeons that fly over the cityscape. Once in a while they rap and sing in a really awkward, uncomfortable way. It doesn't really have a beat, doesn't really have much of a, a weight to it. It's just kind of flat all around, which is what I presume the animation will look like as well if we play our cards right. Yo, I'm a rapping pigeon with much to do. This script came out of 1982 and I don't know why we're rapping at all, but I feel like it's a good call. Just came up with that. On the fly. Like a pigeon. I understand you're looking at one Chloe Grace Moretz for one of the main parts in the film. I would just like to ask one question. Did you get her number? And then I'd like to ask a follow-up question. May I have it? Shut up and listen. I'm a method actor. I'm a mental actor. I'm a physical actor. If you don't have the budget to animate everything, I am a master of disguise. I can Dana Carvey this thing if you want. Not, not, not turtle, turtle, but more like, oh look, the, the little stupid mouse is running up my shirt. Whoa, 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 hey, how is this happening, huh? No animation. It's just the power of illusion. And she's walking away like they always do. Hey, Shania Twain, that don't impress you much? Why don't you come back over here and I'll show you something that does. I have the new Samsung. S10E. S10E. Really? Wow, so I'm already a few phones behind. Okay, well, technology, you know. Hey, Tom, hey, Jerry, come on. Look at you running around me. Whoa, whoa. And then you can just animate them in. There was another role I was really eyeing hard, but I saw Michael Pena was going for it. So I say, let him have the role. But my only suggestion for him acting wise, which he is kind of the master already, but if I could impart one piece of knowledge, it would be look like you don't want to be in the film. I want that to really come out of Michael Pena's eyes. I want him to physically look ill that he took this role. And I think we have a really nice picture on our hands. Is it just me or is Jerry kind of a dick? Like, is he the hero of this? He's always instigating. He's always up to no good. I don't like Jerry. We live in a society. That's not in this? Why did I think that was in this movie? It screams Mouse House. Wait, can I say that? Is that copyrighted? Did you just Batman me? Why do you hate me? Who tortured these onions? You're killing my career. I'm convinced she was raised by wolves. I don't like Jerry. And I actively hope Tom will kill him. I, I want to see him die fiercely. I want teeth gnashing. I want blood falling from that cat's mouth as Jerry looks right at my eyes as he takes his final breath. And I look at his and just think, you are the worst. This is, like, this is a long time coming. And by shy, I mean she scratches people's faces off. <laughs> Sorry, I broke. I broke character. That line is so funny, though. I... <laughs> it's funny. If you pass on Chloe Grace Moretz, I just want to show you something I plan on doing for the majority of the film, which is constantly pushing down on my tie and, and like adjusting my vest. That's going to be a really big part of my character development is just really kind of just pushing at my vest and pushing down on the tie. This is funny. This is comedy. I doubt Chloe Grace Moretz is going to do that. 30 or 40 times. I haven't seen this many shanks since I was in prison. I haven't seen this many skanks since I was at a burlesque house. <laughs> that one's for free. I just can't stand that, that stupid mouse character. She came, she saw, she exterminated. After reading through some of this dialogue and interpreting what I assume is going to happen with this film, I think we have the cartoon equivalent of Casablanca on our hands. 
and I look forward to your call. Like, this is going to be great, Tom. <laughs> <laughs>